Having lost three straight games, the Friars didn't need to hear that leading scorer Eric Murdoch was hospitalized for an irregular heartbeat, but they managed to do just fine without him. That's a three for Carlton Screen to tie it up. Picked up by Screen. Quentin Burton for three. Providence leads. Wow, both teams are going to their perimeter games to start this one, and they're both on fire. In the open court on the block by Constantine on Alonzo Morning. My goodness, now that's something Morning does to everybody else. This has got to be a surprise to him. Abdul Shamsuddin into the picture, yeah. And <laughs> shoot out at the OK Corral. Spectacular shooting evening so far. Screams ahead to Burton. With emphasis by Quentin Burton. Providence was looking to take three weeks of frustration out on Georgetown, and they did most of it from three-point range. Four Friars hit a total of eight trays in the first half, four of those off the hands of Carlton Screen. But the Hoyas can fill it up with the best of them, especially when Mark Tillman and Dwayne Bryant have their radar working. Those two combined for 31 of the Hoyas' 39 first-half points to keep Providence within sight. Neither team could pull away in the second half until Carlton Screen took over. Onlin for three. No. Rebound to Watts. Screen for three. Yes. Oh, it doesn't oh, go in the first time. Try it. Try again. Georgetown looks to extend now more defensively. See if they can get a couple of turnovers, but still playing the zone defensively at the other end. Screen worked himself oh. open beautifully for that. He really did. I think Paco really took over now. You know, you know when they started pressing and the game was really on the line, he wanted the ball and he's, you know, sunk the foul shots. Uh, you know, I think a lot of credit really goes to Paco. We've been down to the wild with a lot of teams, and it feels good to get over the hump and come down the stretch and execute your plays and obviously hit the free throws to win. And I think the team did a great job of that tonight. You know, my teammates, you know, look up to me as being a leader for this team, and I just feel great for everybody, especially the seniors, because you know it's our last go round, and everybody just put in their part in, uh, in order for this win, and I just feel great for everyone. 